Okay, I'm going to show you how to make a polka dot pattern. I'm going to show you two different ways to do it. The first one's going to be pretty easy. I'm just going to come down here to the shape tool, get the circle. I'm going to make a new layer, and then I'm just going to make my circle. Pretty easy. Um, then I'm going to go ahead and turn off the background. Come up here to image, trim. All right, so that's deleted all of the background space. So now I just have my circle. I'm going to go here to image, canvas, and I just want to add a little bit of padding around the polka dot. So I'm just going to move that to one. So now you can see there's space. So this is just going to be my pattern, and I'm just I want to repeat it. So I'm going to come up here and say define pattern. Okay. Then I'm going to open a new canvas over here and get my paint bucket. And I'm going to fill it up here, choose pattern. And then I'm going to scroll down here until I see my circle. Oops, and I want to create a new layer. There you go. There is a simple polka dot pattern. Now, you might want it to do where the polka dots alternate in the rows, which is a little trickier but not too tricky. I'm just gonna go ahead here and make my space a little bigger so I have more space to work with. And I'm gonna take this layer and I'm gonna duplicate it. And then I'm gonna move it up here, duplicate it one more time. Okay, so now I have two. So the two polka dots on top, I'm gonna select them. And then with my move tool, I'm just gonna make sure that they're aligned together vertically like that. And then I'm going to right click here, merge layers. So now they're together. I'm going to go ahead and duplicate that one, drag it down here. So now I have three layers. I'm going to select all of them and I want to make sure they're all lined up together. So now they're lined up that way. And to get equal space between all of them, I'm going to also click on this one. So now the middle dot is, in fact, in the middle. Then I'm going to come back up here, say trim. Trim it down one more time. So now if we make a pattern, we need to actually cut these circles in quarters, which is a little tricky. This is what I do. I'm going to come up here to my magic wand, select this layer, and just I just want to get one circle. So I'm just on this one circle. Then I'm going to come up here to my Info tab. If you don't have your Info tab, you can find it up here, and then it'll come out. So here's my Info, and you can see over here, here's the uh, diameter of the circle. Okay, that's going to be important. And now I'm going to bring out my Canvas as well. So basically what we want to do is subtract the diameter from both the width and the height. So I have my trusty calculator here that I will use, let's see, minus, okay, so that will be the new width, let's get this back, let's see, one point, okay, 1.393, okay, okay, so it's going to clip it. Okay, so now you can see I have a little quarter here. And I'm going to define the pattern. And then come back over here, make a new layer, get my paint my paint can, and then come up here and select the new layer. And there you go. Um, my polka dots are alternating in their rows. You can also always adjust the image size here. So I got that up here under image image size so you can make this you know just one inch and then for some reason this isn't an exact square so I could just go ahead and make it an exact square and then come in here I've just made it a little bit smaller um, so it fits a bit better in the paper so it looks nice and that is how you make a basic polka dot pattern